We entered into a partnership in 2015 as a result of the Sisters of St. Joseph being concerned about their dear neighbor that lives on the east side of Kalamazoo. The families and children and residents that live on the east side could come out and enjoy nature to engage with the natural environment. The sisters have a wonderful natural property just behind their mother house. Bow in the Clouds being one such property and it's a wetland. So the idea of collaboration involved a partnership between the Nature Center and the property that the Sisters of St. Joseph own. But how I've really grown in God's love by being an associate is in growing in my understanding of who the dear neighbor is. When I first became an associate, I was very active in social justice activities at my parish and thought of the dear neighbor in terms of the materially poor. But I have felt God's love really unfolding in me as I've grown to understand that the dear neighbor also includes the spiritually poor. And often that leads me to see those around me, my family, my friends, my neighbors, my coworkers as the dear neighbor. That's what I do all day long with students. I remind them that this journey is about unity for them, about becoming whole and becoming one, and that even when they fall or when they fail, I remind them that their story is unfolding. Loving God and dear neighbor without distinction. I think about this in a very literal sense. Am I treating my friends, my clients, my neighbors? as if I would treat them like God. When I work with a client, I think, what can we do to help make their life better? What can we do to work towards a more just, respectful, and dignified life? How, when, and where I see the presence of God is my recent trip to New Mexico to visit our sister associate. Um, they are the relationships that we built and how we connected with one another was truly an experience where I felt God's love and presence. One of the things that really inspires me when I think of uh, the CSJs and, and the community they built is how they constantly respond to the needs of the time and the people who are, are their neighbors. Um, that's something that I really try to take into my job every day. That's something that the students always respond to. Just that, that really wanting to meet um, people where they are. Coming alongside of each other, working together to identify where there are needs, to serve those needs, to bring unity and reconciliation and love to those places. And I believe that that is truly what serving the dear neighbor is about.